Museum, and here's a special Brighter Christmas edition of Unity. All right, as you guys know, as we approach closer to Christmas time or whatever holiday that you celebrate, um, it is the season for receiving, but it is also the season for giving. So um, now we have a uh, bit of some background information on the Brighter Christmas uh, Foundation. So 35 years ago, Brighter Christmas was started because a family's house burnt down around Christmas time. Well, that's and that's terrible. really tragic. And so um, what Brighter Christmas has turned into is it, it is a service that provides food and presents to families and kids during Christmas time. Brighter Christmas is able to provide for these uh, families and children in need through the use of 350 volunteers. Some money is also awarded through scholarships to seniors if they have volunteered at the foundation. In 2013, Brighter Christmas helped over 800 families and 1,750 children. It's well, pretty great. That's why it's so important to make sure that you guys go out and volunteer because uh, it gives you community service hours and there's a lot of benefits to it. Speaking of community service hours, on Saturday at the mall from 10 to 4, there's the big drive where you can come and bring toys and just hang out and be part of the function. All right, excellent. And um, that does it for our brighter Christmas. And uh, now we're going to move into everyone's favorite segment, Ed's Declassified. School Survival Guide. Hey, it's me again, and I, for the people who don't know me, my name is Ed Perez, and you might remember me from some films such as The Wizard of Ed. Too Fast, Too Eddious, E.D. The Extra Industrial, The Ed Games, Catching Fire, and Ryan the Track, and Iron Ed 3. And you're probably thinking, oh shoot, dude, finals week is coming up. But I'm here. I teach all you guys how to survive finals week. Before we have any chance of surviving this week, you must say goodbye to the ones you love most. Make sure you always study before your test. Es el momento de estudiar, bebé. Mi chico. Oh, and as a side note, make sure you always complete your study guides because you most likely didn't pay attention to that whole semester. True that. All right, George. Question uno. What does hola mean? I'm somewhere here. Two hours later. Man, I'm zooming through the study guide. Alright, Jorge, what'd you get? Um. Come on, George, just get out of here. Sorry. Right. Anyway, let's move on to tip number two. You don't want to cheat, I and mean, it's common sense. Unless you want to be like this kid. <laughs> Since when did we learn this? Whoa, slow down, bro. Did you even watch the last as declassified? Sorry, man. I don't listen to this kid. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Josh, what is this? Uh, Chrome? It was just a piece of scratch paper. For a Spanish test? Boy. You telling me how to take a test? That's child abuse. What was happening? Oh no, you failed your final. Again. Wait, does that mean I don't have to take the test? Alright!
school survival guide. Your results may vary. <laughs> All right, thanks for that, Ed, and everyone else who helped put that together. Now, JT, is it time for Falcon Pride? I think it is. All right, one, two, three. Falcon Pride! Yeah!